I've never really believed in true evil. At least not until that night in the cabin. The night we found the book. Necronomicon Ex Mortis. The Book of the Dead. Inked in blood and bound in human flesh, the book holds the power to resurrect demons and summon the powers of darkness. Professor Raymond Noby brought the Necronomicon to this quiet place years ago to study the book to unlock its secrets. He was never seen again. When we read it, we awoke something in the woods. A dark, infectious evil as old as time. It got into my hand and it went bad, so I cut it off. It got to the others too, twisting them, changing them. They became something less than human. That's when they came for me. Six months and not a single visit. Oh yeah, my appeal must be coming along swell. Hey, you know what? Give me the bad news and blow. TV time starts in five. Your whole story, the Necronomicon, your friends being possessed by evil, you being forced to butcher them. You were telling the truth. I thought you were crazy. Professor Noby's diary? But how did you... I, uh... I bribed a janitor to grab your files from Dr. Reinhardt's office this morning. Dr. Reinhardt's office? Why would my shrink have Noby's diary? That doesn't make any sense. Noby's diary? It was in the cabin right beside the Necronomicon. I have to get to the authorities before Reinhardt realizes this book is missing. Hey, uh, I just wanted to say, uh, thanks for believing in me. You know, I just to, you know, I bet you'd be some kind of a knockout if you traded in the granny wear for thigh-high stockings and a bra that pushed up your yams. Yams? Oh, baby smooth, Ashinova. What are you up to?
Touch craftsmanship. So diabolically beautiful. Necronomicon ex mortis. Fate brought you to me, but it is destiny and my own brilliance that will allow us to reshape the world. It is time to release the power of the dead. Are you talking to me, Doc? Or is this another one of your crazy mad scientist rants? Even your sarcasm can't ruin my mood today. In fact, I should be thanking you. You proved that a living being could experience the power of this amazing book without succumbing to its evil. I'm just sorry that my experiments on you proved fatal. <laughs> Ain't this a kick in the pants? Stopper, you're going down! It's, you're going down hard! <laughs> Let's see if these freaks are still allergic to lead. Possessions? Come on, come on, where are you? Hey, dude. Serve your energy, Static Cling, because you're going to need every stinking volt.
What was that? You can't believe you just got your ass kicked by a one-handed nut job? What? Oh, you think I'm your daddy? Listen up, shake and bake. I eat evil for breakfast and danger for dinner, so spread the word. Ash is back in business. Nobi. What the Reinhardt has used the Necronomicon to open a series of portals, each one allowing evil to spread through the world, corrupting all in its path. You must stop him. Look, Nobs, let's get this straight. All I must do is get the hell out of here. Now where's the damn fire exit? You can escape this sanitarium, but not the threat that Reinhardt poses. And neither can Sally. Sally? My lawyer? What's she got to do with this? Reinhardt needs my diary to complete his work. And he sent his evil minions to pursue her. Damn, I mean, I know she's a lawyer, but she doesn't deserve that. I mean, sure, she's a little uptight and square, but I think there's something freaky-deaky going on there, too. You know what I'm saying? Well, she was trying to help me, so... Oh, damn. All right, what do I need to do? You must close the portals between this world and the next, for they are the source of Reinhardt's power. Repair breaches. Okay, got it. But you won't be able to do it alone. Uh, no offense, Professor, but uh, how do I put this? You're a big useless ghost head. He's talking about me, Hero! Yeah! Oh! Ash, Sam was once a patient. Dr. Reinhardt used the Necronomicon to change him into the creature you see before you. He's a dead eye. End of story. Okay. Bad voice impression. Sam is spiritually connected to the book, but his soul remains untarnished by evil. He can sense where the portals are. He knows the necessary incantations to close them. You will fail without his help. All right, we go. But if you get all dead-eyed on me, even for a second, I'll carve you up like a Christmas goose. You got that, Stubby? Reality check! Who you calling Stubby? Stubby? Peachy. Oh, well, Sally girl, I guess you're camping out tonight. I smell is trouble. Stay focused, Runt. Hey, we need to get through here. I can feel it. Too thick to slice and dice. That cave might go through. And will you look at that? It's all custom designed for pulse-free loudmouths under three feet tall. Mac! Mac! Mother of all disease! Lord of unholy pestilence! What is your malfunction, shrimp? Quit pole dancing on my leg. Do you know how many germs these rats are packing? Syphilis? Polio? Gingivitis? Little petri dishes would teach for freak's sake. I'd rather suck face with a sewage The Necronomicon's power comes from the ancient symbols that fill its pages. I have scribed some of these symbols along your path. Seek them out and learn to use them. 
With this particular symbol, you can temporarily take possession of other demons. If I go puppet master on bacon bit here, will I be able to shut his stinking pie hole? You will be able to do much more than that. Just stand on the symbol. Whoa! I don't know what's beyond this point, but I know that's what we will want. Guarding the catacombs before you is a soul eater. To pass through, Sam must gather three imprisoned spirits as an offering. Once fed, the beast will slumber, allowing you to pass. Okay, so what you're saying is feed peepers his sleepy treats and sneak past while he's snoozing? Mm-hmm, got it. But be warned! The final spirit is guarded by the most vile of creatures. They will stop at nothing to end your quest. The first spirit. Well, go on, hurry up, Runt. This chainsaw ain't getting any lighter. Timpano, Imazu, Noro, Iposi. Ah! Feels like there's an evil moss pit in my gut. Let's get this thing back to the gate. And watch my back. If I die, this thing will be free to return to its demonic hidey hole. Come on, come on, just finish it. the time. The Necronomicon isn't just a history of evil. It's a riddle that offers its master ghastly dark power and the ability to destroy mankind. I, Professor Raymond Noby, now know my purpose in life and death. I must do whatever is necessary to stop the book. Way to lay on the melodrama, Professor. If you say one word... The portal, it's close. And there's something else. A powerful evil. Somewhere near here. Very near. You don't say. the portal, Runt. Now go ahead, do your thing. And don't screw up. Nice freaking pep talk. Wow! <laughs> 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 Hello? 
I hate to interrupt your beauty sleep, lady. Yeesh. But let's not kid ourselves. You need a few million more winks to make a dent in that grill. Well, if that's how you want it, come get some. Each enemy you destroy, you will strengthen the evil within you. When this evil builds to a sufficient strength, you can call forth your darker self. All right, I get it. You kill Deadeyes, absorb their evil mojo, unleash badass, kick major ass. Makes perfect sense to me. Cork it, Deadite. Just find me the next portal. Oh, mighty book of the dead. Why have you brought me to this place? Please, give a Professor Raymond Nobis diary to me so I can discover what I've done wrong. You return with nothing? Worthless beast! Go back and find the diary! <coughs> I will be lost! Stupid book. Stupid Novi. I'd like to give that egghead a boomstick migraine. You know, you really need to work on your anger. Hey, tell me, know nothing. What do I have to lop off to keep you quiet? What? Uh, we need to motor. Pronto. Fucking right. <laughs> hey, lucky day. Could come in handy. That is, if it works. Oh, sorry. Slipped. Yeah. This could come in real handy. Abandoned mine shaft. Now, isn't this cozy? Dark, stinky, terrifying. 
Well, I'm not getting one of my premonitions, but considering our crap luck, I'm guessing the portal's in here. Brunt, that's the first sensible thought you've had all day. Let's go. Nice mug. Any relation? Why do you gotta keep busting my ball? Flash souls! All right, enough already. It's time to give Junior his bottle. Sam. <clears throat> Primo Vittaviti. Uh, bang him, hang him, wang. Hell, almighty. Reinhardt has found Sally and my diary. <laughs> Reinhardt has kept her alive, and just a few portals remain. You can still save her, and the world. Woo Somebody call a cab? Something very dear to me. These horrible beasts, my God! Where have you brought me? Record all that you witness. History must know the details of man's extinction. <laughs> nice park job, Runt. Hey, what I lack in precision to make up for in possess. Certainly have a chubby for trash, huh? What 
can I get you to cobbling together now? Electrified bass fishing rod? Ninja can opener? Will you please shut your freaking mouth? That's a boomstick. Any chance that's a broken air conditioner? Huh. That's good. if it isn't the one that got away. You, saw it off. Close the portal. On it. <sighs> the task that Dr. Reinhardt has failed to complete, the information he needed from my diary, it involves a human sacrifice. It is only a matter of time before he puts it together. Sally. Power is derived from a link between two worlds. That of the living and the dead. The living and the dead. To me! Wonderful. What? <clears throat> Standing one is like club dead for creepy crawlies. Okay, okay, just spare me the psychosis. Now the next portal. You sure it's this way? No doubt. Then strap on your waiters, runt boy. We're going in. Ash, isn't it great with finally pals? I mean, we had a pretty rough start, but you know. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Okay. Reality check, twerp. I'm not your pal. Yes, sir. Primo pals. Best buds. Soul sisters. Well, looky here. Ooh, that looks deadly.
for a lift. Check. <sighs> Yeah, too quiet. Let's go make some noise. Ooh. Pretty chainsaw. Compression release. Customized tuned pipe, 50-inch vented titanium blade. Just like the one in my dream. Where have you been all my life? Ooh. Security guards, blood sucking ghosts, killer sea midget. Maybe a butt kicking reputation precedes us. Now step aside. It's time for Sam the Man's Lights and Magic Show. <laughs> oh, man, I am wiped out. And, uh,. I know, so be woe. As I'm... Desperatus and Mantis. Candor. Tell me you didn't just yawn during the incantation. Another portal. I must complete my work. Please, Doctor. This is madness. Madness is the key to genius, Miss Paula. And take your sacrifice, for example. Such a brilliant, simple gesture. And yet one that could be misconstrued as a little not so. A little? Quiet! You will die here, so that the dead might roam forever. And no matter how many portals he closes on the earthly plane, there's nothing that Middlesome Ash can do to stop me. Nothing! Ash? I guess that portal was broken. Oh, yeah? Well, that portal and your neck are about to have something in common. Damn, Noby. You look like Run's about to feel. You've been pulled into an alternate dimension. One that Reinhardt has been using to gain power and hide from earthly attack. There is no escape unless find his lair and destroy him. Oh, typical. I have little power in this evil place. I can go no further on this journey with you. Know that mankind owes you a tremendous uh. debt, as do I. Ah, save the good guy act for the funny papers, you self-important geek. 
The only people I'm out to save are me and Sally. And maybe that creep over there. Oh, that's, that's right. That's right. So why don't you make like a nose and run? You big nose. Oh, that's telling him. This is it. Reinhardt's lair. The final chapter. The last stand. We made a hell of a duo, didn't we? Partner. Uh, yeah, yeah, what you said. All right, then. Now let's butcher this little bastard. Knock, knock. Ash! Us. Impossible! Ah, jeez. We should consider ourselves lucky, Runt. He could have set up shop in the House of Mirrors. I underestimated you, Ash. And you too, Sam. How have you been, my little failed experiment? Still dead, I'm guessing? Well, what are you, sadistic monster? Why don't you... Go hump a stump! Uh, maybe you should let me handle the witty banter, okay? There's no way to start the Necronomicon! Its power courses through my flesh! You both come such an awfully long way to die! Got time for one more session, Doc? I'm ready to resolve my anger issues. When you get to hell, tell him Ash sent you. Save the planet. Two years have tortured me. Who's dead? No! Dead guy? I mean, I'm dead too, but, but still, you, you jack off. Sally, uh, I fought some crazy odds and came a very long way to tell you something. Yes? I just wanted to, well, apologize for the fashion advice I gave you back at Sunny Meadow. How about this? Oh, I'd forgotten you'd even said that. Until now. Tell the crib from dead. <gasps> I hope you like it rough, lover boy. Let's dance. You, I was kind of expecting a girl who showed off a little more, you know, va va voom. 